What's up guys? Happy 2019. This video is going to be a what I eat in a day whole 30 edition because I'm doing whole 30 for the month of January with some of my friends and my roommates. And if you're curious about my opinion, I'll just say it very quickly. I'm, I'm totally not a fan of like diets labeling your diet restriction in any way i think like a balance is the best way to do it however after the holiday season and just since moving to new york i've just like gotten into a really bad cycle of eating healthy during the week and binging and relying on sweets to like get me through the day can't even like really explain to you how much sweets i had over the holidays um it's really embarrassing you know that you need to know your good friend miranda hobbs has just taken a piece of cake out of the garbage and eaten it. You'll probably need this information when you check me into the Betty Crocker Clinic. So I'm not gonna get into it, but I needed something with rules and guidelines and something that would get me back to looking at ingredients and caring about what I'm putting in my body. That is why I'm doing Whole30. This video is sponsored by HelloFresh and I, you guys have heard of this, but it's a meal delivery service and it's actually like comes out, I think, I'm not sure what it prices out average per meal, but it's so inexpensive you guys and you can always take leftovers for lunch the next day. So I got my box. It comes with all the meals pre-packaged in their own separate baggies. And then there's like an ice pack with the meat, which I already put in the fridge. Three meal plans. So we have the Shake It Up Pork Cutlets, the Mexican Chicken and Rice Bowl, Amazing Apricot Chicken. And they have like different options, so you can get like a four person if you have a family, or just for yourself, there's vegetarian options as well. They're really customizable. And then also with all of these, they're super easy to make Whole30. This one, I think I only not have the apricot jam, so I'll just leave that out. Um, I'm gonna head to the grocery store right now to get some cauliflower rice, which I can sub for the jasmine rice in this Mexican bowl, and I think I'm gonna have this for lunch and dinner. And then on this one, I would just skip the breading on the pork and skip the bread. So, super easy, super fresh. I'm gonna show you guys what it's all about when it comes to lunchtime. Right now, I'm just starting my day off with a cup of black coffee, and then me and my roommate Mal are gonna run to the grocery store to get that rice. Also, if you guys want six free HelloFresh meals, I'll have all the information listed in the description bar below. It's like the perfect freaking time to try out HelloFresh because it's the new year and everyone wants to do something good for themselves and this is just like the easiest way to start. I don't know if you're like me, like I prioritize my spending on like food and workouts because those things are bettering myself and my body. Do something for yourself for the new year. Treat yourself, get some healthy meals. So let's just get into the rest of the video. We're gonna go to the grocery store now. It was raining outside, sorry. Mal <laughs> doesn't want to be in the vlog. No. <laughs> this looks yum. Seaweed. There's sugar in it. FML. We got a basket, that'd be helpful. Let me get a basket. So I'm gonna start making breakfast. I'm having some potatoes. I'm going to make two eggs and then I'm going to have some fruit on the side. So I'll show you guys the finished product. Okay, so for breakfast I'm having two soft boiled eggs which you just put in boiling water with the shell on for six and a half minutes and then transfer them into an ice bowl. And then I'm having some roasted potatoes and some grapes on the side and then I just put some kale underneath the eggs to get some greens in and because it honestly looks pretty. I'm going to have some ketchup with my potatoes. So this one is Whole30 approved. It's the Primal Kitchen Ketchup Organic Unsweetened. And then I'm also going to put probably some hot sauce on my eggs but that is breakfast and yeah and I also just went ahead and put the rest of the potatoes in a Tupperware and I'll put them in the fridge so I can have them for breakfast throughout the week or add them to my salads holy oh. shit I'm cleaning my room right now I thought I'd keep you guys updated for a snack, I've been having the extra virgin olive oil premium roasted seaweed. It's just olive oil and sea salt. And I ate the whole pack, but <laughs> it's only 50 calories for the whole 
pack with the whole 30 you're supposed to try to stop snacking i'm not really like a big snacker anyways and seaweed's supposed to be actually really good for you so okay just opened the hello fresh mexican chicken and rice bowl and then instead of the rice that it came with i'm going to use the rice cauliflower because that's whole 30 i'm also going to ditch the sour cream then it comes with chicken um hot sauce is southwest spice blend which um you put on the chicken so everything's pre-measured out turmeric you put on the rice and then it comes with a tomato a lime a green pepper and some onion or scallions this is onions right anyway so i'm going to start cooking the chicken and then this rice you can actually just microwave So I just cooked my chicken in a separate bowl. Now I'm going to go ahead and cook my green peppers. I'm chopping up the rest of my veggie to make the salsa. So I have my rice and then I made the salsa, the chicken, and the peppers and that's pretty much it. Okay, so I went ahead and put everything together. Yeah, it also made like quite a bit extra so I can have it for lunch tomorrow. So good. How did I do? I think it looks really similar to the picture actually. Like, it, even the plate is, like, white. Mm-hmm. I'm also going to put hot sauce on it. How did I do? <laughs> Don't forget to check the description bar if you guys want to check out HelloFresh. It was so easy. That literally took me, like, 20 minutes to make this entire thing. It's also way better than anything I usually make. My lighting in here is so awful. Since I ate my breakfast around lunchtime, I'm actually waiting until dinner to eat this. Probably how, like, an apple after dinner is, like, dessert. But that's the game plan. Put it all into a bowl and I'm gonna eat it with my roommates as we watch a movie. And then I think we're having some of our friends over. And since um, Whole30, uh, you can't have alcohol, I went and picked up some sparkling water um, as like a treat, lol. But yeah, I'll keep you guys posted if I have anything else tonight, if I'm still hungry after dinner. And yeah, that meal was looks so fire. I'm about to devour. The proposal. No. I'd watch that. It's going she's to be my dessert. Anymore, okay, guys, sorry. I kind of <laughs> forgot to end last night's vlog. But tonight is Sunday, and I just finished up the chicken that I had yesterday the um, with rice for dinner. And then I'm going to make this tonight so I can have it for lunch tomorrow at work. And then I'm also going to have it for um, dinner tomorrow, too. And that way I'm just making the most out of these meals. So it came packed with green beans. I think this is thyme. This really cute apricot jam, which unfortunately I can't use just cause it's not Whole30, it has sugar in it, but usually would be so good. And also how cute is this container? It's this mini balsamic vinegar. Comes one um, shallot. There is some potatoes. <laughs> Okay, so sorry for the sh lighting, but um, I just made the chicken and put it in a Tupperware and same with the green beans and then I'm gonna, I have some leftover potatoes so I'm gonna save the ones that came with my meal, um, but I'll bring this for work tomorrow. It took me like probably a half hour or less and now I'm meal prepped for, honestly this will probably last me like three meals just because I don't eat like a whole chicken breast, it's kind of a lot. Trying to figure out our television. Look like an egg. Such a good angle. So you know what to do about these. Hey guys, I just wanted to pop on and say thank you so much for watching this video. And if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Definitely comment below more video ideas that you want to see. And um, I'll see you guys in my next video. Make sure to follow, follow, follow. Am I okay? Follow all of my, follow. Oh.